Hello everyone and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. We've hit 45 hours. We are rocking the Havel set. I think, did we, did we manage to wear the full Havel set now? I think with a couple of levels in vitality, I think we just about managed. Yeah, look at us. Apart from the shield, obviously. But uh, we are looking pretty freaking dope. So, last time... Uh, we did a lot of we did a lot of catch up on things that you guys had asked me to do whilst I was on holiday, which was pretty cool. And then we went through the fog door in the undead crypt and uh, defeated Velstat, who was dope, and then found the king. And he's like a husk; he's a shell of his former self. And we got the king's ring, which is going to allow us to open a few doors. Oh, I fucked it! <laughs> Jesus, really? That drop did that much? Um, I thought that was a different ladder. Because, apparently, and now that you guys mention it, I think I actually do remember. But, uh, there is a another place. You know what? I'm going to just climb back up this ladder. Wait. Hello? Can you not re-climb the ladder? Why? Uh-oh. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. Okay. This is this has started out poorly. Uh Didn't I buy the cat right there it is. There is another of those doors. Anyway, I'm not sure I finished that fucking train of thought. Oh. That can be opened. Uh, by having that forgotten key thing. So, that's what we're going to do. It's like somewhere down. Oh, actually, I think is it... Oh, it's right there. Okay. Ah, shit then. Am I going to... I'm not going to be able to make this jump, am I? Fucked it. I think I've fucked it. You know what? You know what? Let's just do a hard reset <laughs> on this whole mission. Uh... Man, I thought I'd never use Homeward Bones. I was like, they're just so unnecessary. And then <laughs> the last few parts, I've just been smashing them out. Okay, anyway. I think it's this ladder then. It's the one nearest me, not the one on the side. Dope. And yeah, we did find this door before, but we couldn't open it. And uh, now we can. So let's see what we have. And then, yeah, we need to... Oh, also, we need to just quickly pop back to the gutter. Because apparently, that item from that one chest, it was not supposed... Hello? There we go. It was not supposed to fall through the... Oh, you can climb back up this ladder, huh? It was not supposed to fall through the floor. And uh, resetting may just have it lying there where it's supposed to be. So, nice. I think this is the third and final one of this. But uh, let me know if there are any more. Couple of chests. Three chests. No? Okay. <laughs> oh, hello. Dragon Talon Key. Ooh, is this guides one to an unknown land? I think that is the third DLC key. A terribly worn dragon talon. Legend has it that in the deepest reaches of the Black Gulch, behind a door locked from the inside, is a magnificent city built for a great slumbering dragon. This talon clearly dates to ancient times, but great vitality emanates from it still. Hmm. In the deepest reach of the Black Gulch, behind a door locked from the inside, a magnificent city. Oh boy. <sighs> behind the Black Gulch. Is a worrying prospect, though. <laughs> Are there going to be lots of those fucking poison statues? Soul Vortex. Uh, oh, we already have that. Witch Tree Branch and Witch Tree Belvine. Where would a branch go? Uh, hmm. Can we spot anything that looks like a branch? I thought maybe it'd be down the bottom. 
Okay, let's just <laughs> do it this way. Never mind. It's not one of these. It's one of these, I guess. Witch tree branch and witch tree bell vine. Right. Branch of a forest wandering witch tree. A catalyst for sorceries and hexes. Now it is used as a weapon, but this was originally a part of a witch tree. Wow, thank you for that in-depth lore. Witch tree bell vine. This looks more like it. Witch tree bell vine that sprouts amongst old growth. Clerics who were ostracised devised this as an alternative catalyst for casting miracles. Most clerics who are stripped of their status are good for nothings, but among them are powerful spellcasters who represented real threats to the establishment. Although not a proper catalyst, the Belvine is quite powerful. Nice. And the Great Lightning Spear. Uh, hello. Uh, it's the exact same as the regular lightning spear. Okay. Well, the three jets were kind of rubbish, but this <laughs> right here, that is what we want. That is definitely a good find. Right, is there any cheeky illusions hiding here? That's weird. I can walk behind... Oh, wait. Is it just... No? I can walk behind this chest, but not this one. And they're the same chest, positioned at the same point. Very strange. What about this one? Nope, can't do this one either. That is very weird. Right. So. Uh, back up we go. And let's portal on over to the guttery goo. Hopefully that'll take all of five minutes, and then we can progress. Oh my god, I forget how long this ladder is, and you can't angle the camera upwards whilst you're climbing. This is, you're just stuck here, so. There we go. Lovely grey skies. Meow. Oh! Also, I should upgrade my fucking uh, shield and uh, bow. Good shout, people. I have a lot of upgrade materials that are just sitting there right now. Uh, where is my shield? This one. It requires twinkling, though. All right. That's a... Hmm. Then again, this is just upgrading its magic defenses, which I don't really need. And half of them are so low anyway that it probably wouldn't really matter. Do I really want to spend a bunch of twinkling? I know I just did spend one, but hang on. Let's have a look at the bow. I feel like the bow would be... Uh... Hunter's Black Bow. That was the one I was using. Okay, this would actually be useful. Oh, I have 61 Titanite Shards? Really? I have no memory of that. I have no memory of getting that many. Oh, now it's using large. Okay. Okay, and now I don't have enough. <laughs> I got it up to plus six. That's pretty good. That's all right. Do I have any souls to pop? I think I do have a huge one, but I don't know that I want to use that. Yeah, I have one huge one. Ah, we'll just come back to that later. Yeah, I'm not sure that I want to upgrade the uh, shield if it costs twinkling, when it's not actually going to be making that much difference. Uh, right, the gutter, the first one, and then it was just all the way to the right, wasn't it? I think. Let's just uh, dash on through. 
dashing through the gutter. Almost falling off. <laughs> I don't want to die. Can't think of something that rhymes with off. <laughs> Okay, and then it was just down the edge here, right? I can't actually see the ground. Oh, there it is. Fuck you. And over here. And then is the item up there, or...? Hmm. Where is the item? Shouldn't it be sitting there? Well, I can't see it down the bottom either. Does it just despawn? That would be a feels bad. Hmm. Oh my god, I actually really... Now I can do it. Now I fucking manage it. I can't believe that. I tried for so long last time, and then this time I first try it, and the item's not even here. Fuck you, game. Hello, friends. Oof. Get up. What a bummer. What a huge bummer. Oh well. <laughs> Back we go, I guess. Hello. Oh, there was another item in there. Meh. Right. Um. What was I doing? Oh yeah. Homeward bone. <laughs> okay. Now, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? I would actually quite like to... I know this is stalling progress <laughs> just a little bit, but I would actually quite like to, because this uh, Return to Drang Lake event thing is on, I would like to just try uh, the PvP statue one more time. I don't know if I need to be in the correct covenant for it. Uh, which is a ring, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Maybe I should put this on. Now that people are playing again. Maybe? Oh, I'd have to actually go and join the Covenant, wouldn't I? Well, let's see if anyone's around. Oh, you do have to be wearing the... Oh, no, you just have to be in the Covenant. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Bye -bye. I think that was new dialogue, but oh well. Didn't seem too important. Hmm. Let's see some... Huh. Let's see. Is there going to be anyone around? Come on, baby. Come on, baby. No. <laughs> no. Damn it. I just want some PvP. Uh, let's try... I can't remember if you have to. I can't remember. We did discover, but it's completely uh, gone from my mind. Whether you actually have to be in an area for their summoning thing to work, or can I just join the Rat King Covenant here and I'll just be summoned? Uh, he was through here, wasn't he? I 
gone. My servant. Now, do I have to be wearing this? Hmm, not sure. The thing's not glowing in the top left. I thought it glowed when you... Speak then. My when you were, like, searching. Do not disappoint. Is that not how it works? Hmm. Is this Rat King Covenant the same as the Doors of Pharos version? Where are the Doors of Pharos? Here they are. Was he around here somewhere? Yeah, he was just after here, wasn't he? Speak thy mind. Okay, so it is the same. My servant. Hmm. Unless you have to be human? Nope, that doesn't do it. That doesn't make it glow either. What am I thinking of then? I could have sworn. I just I just want some PvP. Maybe, actually. Uh, <laughs> one last thing to try. One last thing to try. Let's uh, go to the threshold bridge and see if we can spot any summon signs. Probably not. We're probably still too high level, but... It's worth a look. Seems like that's a straight no. <laughs> Damn it, game. Hmm. Oh well. Oh well. Right. Okay, let's actually move on. Let us move on. So, we have multiple doors to open. Ow. I just kicked my chair with the back of my heel. That is some severe pain. Uh, for the life of me, I've forgotten the location of all of them. Oh, Forest of Fallen Giants was one. Let's go have a little look-see. We found this door right at the beginning of the game. Also, <laughs> can you believe we're past 70 parts now? Because I had a moment where I looked at the part number while I was editing. And I was like, holy shit, we really are going to break 100, aren't we? <laughs> I really didn't think. You guys told me. Uh, wait, no, it wasn't this way. You guys told me fairly early on that it was going to break 100 parts. And I was like, nah, <laughs> there's no way. There's no way this breaks 100 parts. But... The DLC, I assume, three DLCs is going to be at least a month, which means we are going to break 100 parts. Produce this- oh, right, I need to be wearing the ring, don't I? Opens the king's gate. There we go. Cool door. Very slow opening cool door. Can I just straight up take the ring off again? <laughs> Hello. I didn't realise there was a bonfire in the forest that I hadn't found. The place unbeknownst. Interesting. Got another giant tree. Oh, this is okay. Yeah, I know where we are. Cool. Looks like there used to be a pillar holding that up. Ex 
examine. Alas, nothing happened. I think we found one of these examine, alas, nothing happened trees before, right? Hmm. Oh, and then this is how you get down to those items. Huh, there's an actual thing there? Did I fuck up? Should I have rolled off behind the tree? I don't think there was actually a way to do that. Hmm. What is it? Ah! Twinkling times two and a fragrant branch of yore. That's amazing. There's a whole fucking place here. How do I get to it? Was it that I was supposed to roll off in a different way? I actually need to start buying more of these now. <laughs> we are actually getting low. We had like 30 or something. Could I? No, you can't. I don't think. Hmm. But that's definitely a thing. Unless it's just like, you can look at it but you can't see it. Maybe you're just not actually supposed to go into that area. But it looks like a real place. I don't want to spend too much time on it. I guess this door wasn't really anything. But let me know if there is a way to, uh, to get to there. Next up, uh, Shaded Woods. And that fucking ogre. <laughs> we've, we've tried to go this way three times now. And hopefully this will be the charm. Damn it, I can never get those guys. Right, hello. You slut. As if he still hit me. Bye. Bye bye. Right. Do do do. Open sesame. Is it going to be another kind of giant tree? Well, there is a tree. <laughs> All of this. Aldia's keep. Aldia's keep. Hello. Aldia, brother of uh, Vendrick. Soul of a nameless soldier and petrified dragon bone. Oh, look at those windows. <laughs> they look dope. Love to see it. Poison throwing knife. Lots of these little fucking things. Alluring skull. Is it Aldia or Aldia or Aldia? Mimicry. Oh, really? Don't you dare. That's alright. I pack a big enough punch now that I can kill them before they come out. You can't... It's, good, it's cool. You can't lock onto them before they come out. Eat shit and die. Oh shit. No. He takes more hits. Oh shit. Oh shit. He takes more hits. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to run back there, aren't I? Because I didn't find a bonfire. God damn it. God damn it. Well, we will get him. <laughs> Fucking bitch. Yeah, Aldea's the one that was, uh, like, experimenting on people, right? 
we read a lore description that was like lots of people went to where Aldea's at, but not none came out or something. Do 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 do. Oh no! I hope the door doesn't close every time. Oh, the door closes every time, motherfuckers. Why? <laughs> but why though? Oh, I, it opens for me without putting on the ring after I've done it once though. But it's so slow. <laughs> Let me in. Let me in. Okay, so how best to take on this mimic then? Well, I guess the first thing would be to actually be on full health when I attack it, which I was not there. Fucking little creepy skull in the grass. Donk. I guess hit it three times and then back up whilst it pops out and maybe see if I can fireball it. One, two, three, back up. And fireball. Oh, nice. I didn't even need the second one. Plan to perfection. The dark mask and the malformed skull. Ooh. Where would the... Oh, is that it? Yeah. The skull of some unidentifiable creature. Swing as a great hammer to use as a weapon. Possibly the skull of a dragon. A rare specimen. Likely too rare to be swung about willy-nilly. That sounds cool. Where it at? 35 strength. And it has no scaling? <laughs> what? What's it look like? Ho oh. ho! It looks dope. Kind of clips through Havel's head, though. <laughs> Weird that it has no scaling at all. Did I try looking at this? Because that looks kind of cool. Ah, oh, it just, like, sticks on the end of your arm. Huh. <laughs> Oh, where on earth is my beautiful sword? I always lose it. And I know, yeah, yeah, I should clean up my inventory. Put some stuff in the item box. But I really like seeing... Oh, there it is. I really like seeing all of our accomplishments, you know. Everything we have achieved thus far. Okay. Oh, is that a fucking... That is a bonfire. God damn it. Hi! She's taking her mask off. She's like half hollowed though. That's the first time we've seen her. We we had we sort of could get a look at her before in the No Man's Wharf one, I think, but not properly. Oh, I've just noticed I've got chains around my wrists, like I'm fucking God of War. That's cool. Um but yeah, we haven't had a proper, like, straight-on view of her face before. Looking good, lady. Who are you? Ah. That's oh. an issue. No. Forgive me. I know you. Yes, of course. How goes your journey? Ah, uh, so-so. I know not what you seek in this faraway land. But I pray for your safety. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Please take these. Oh, hello. The Mirror Greatsword and Lucatiel's entire set. Consider this thanks for keeping me sane. My name is Lucatiel. I beg of you, remember my name. Oh, baby, I won't be forgetting it. For I may not myself. 
definitely my favourite NPC in any of the Souls games so far. My name is Luca Tilo. Oh, that's it. I beg of you, remember my name. For I may not myself. Okay. So. Is that the end of the quest line then? She gives you all her gear? Is that what would not happen if I uh, hadn't done the three fights thing? You were right that I needed to do it pretty much immediately then, because that was like right after the undead crypt boss. Um, right, mirror greatsword. Is that going to be around here? No, we've gone... Oh, there, there. Mirror greatsword. Greatsword issued to the proud knights of Mirror's official order. This one was wielded by Luca Teal. This greatsword demands advanced skill in a rare and unique sword technique. A tiny message is inscribed in the blade, a promise to someone special. Oh, it's literally right next to my Drangleic sword. Ha! Huh. It has an A scaling on decks. This one only... Oh, no, this one, the Drangleic does have A. Never mind. Looks fairly cool. Is that the same moveset as the Dranglaic Sword? I guess it would make sense if they're next to each other. Yeah, because this is a great sword as well, isn't it? It just <laughs> deals way more damage because I've maxed it out. Hmm. That's cool. And then what was the other stuff? Uh, the mirror set. Not the mirror set, the Luca Teal set. Where would that be? Oh shit, I forgot to read the stuff that I picked up from the whatchamacallit, the, the, the mimic. The Dark Mask. Mask of a knight subsumed by the dark. No one knows the true identity of these men who are said to freely manipulate dark. Old foreign legends describe them as poor souls who chased the lost art of life drain. Oh, that is fucking sick looking. And Lucatiel's mask. Mask attached to a ceremonial hat belonged to Lucatiel of Mirror. Normally hats and masks are separate, but these two have been adjoined. Wait. But no, they haven't though, because she's still wearing her hat <laughs> and not her mask. <laughs> Tell me more. Um, shit, I can't remember what the other thing I picked up from the chest was. It was the dark mask and something. Lucatiel's vest. Vest worn by knights while on travel. Only those who have distinguished themselves on the battlefield were admitted into the elite ranks of Mira's official Order of Knights. It is common to hear of a peasant's dream of striving for knighthood as an escape from hardship. But, whoever, but who would ever think it possible? What was the other thing I got? Was it a weapon? Mm, damn it. Oh, wait. The, was it the bone staff? No. No, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Sugar. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I... I messed up. <laughs> I don't remember. What the other thing we got was. It's just, oh, was it the darks? No, I'm pretty sure we already... It's, uh, it was something to do with dark. I think. But, uh... Unfortunately, it escapes me. I'll have to look back... When I'm, uh... When I'm editing. Because none of these are standing out to me as... This is the thing you just picked up. Bollocks. Oh, well. Um... We did that one. And that's the same. And this is probably the same. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Was it a ring that I picked up? Oh, I hate myself for doing that. Why? Why did I already forget? Go. 
Gosh darn. Okay. Well, whatever. It is what it is. Shall we uh, try out some of this? I'm sure it will not be as good. Oh my god, yeah, look at that. But. <laughs> oh, just the vibe of it, though. Oh my god, can I please just look up without getting fucked by grass? There we go. You would not want to meet that on a dark night, would you? Jesus Christ. That is terrifying. Hmm. It's a me, look at deal. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. I love it. That really does look good. But it's much worse, though. <laughs> it won't be staying. But uh, very cool. Very, very cool. Okay, so. You definitely done? My name is Luke. Yeah. My no, God damn it! I'm trying to read the message. Misfortune ahead, therefore try tears. She does disappear if you rest. Okay, moves on to the next location, so potentially not done with her story. Other thing I was thinking of is maybe if we join the Belfry one, would that potentially get me summoned? 